Welcome to LADA Star of Langkawi presentation for the Kuala Lumpur Fashion Weekend 2021, supported by Punjana, KKMM, and My Creative. This year, the KL Fashion Weekend, which is a consumer event, is making a momentous return with a new twist. It's the first fashion event to be presented in Fidgetal. Do you know what that means? It's a combination of both physical and digital, okay? Because everything is being recorded today as well. So apart from calling upon the fashion industry practitioners at all levels and fashion consumers to embrace sustainability and ethics, the KL Fashion Weekend 2021 pioneers as the first to introduce NFTs for fashion and a metaverse designer exhibition. So that's pretty forward thinking. The Kale Fashion Weekend 2021 is viewed as the jumpstart for a renaissance movement of the creative arts in Malaysia following the pandemic after effects. Isn't it nice to be out and see your friends and watch something other than Netflix? It's so nice. My creative is here to play its part to help promote and support this industry by offering loans and grants and training to upskill, especially digital skills and marketing efforts online. The Lada Star of Langkawi, which is what we are here today to watch, is a program to promote the fashion talents of Langkawi. It's an initiative by the KL Fashion Weekend to be in collaboration with LADA, the Langkawi Development Authority, and it's primarily to reach out to designers outside Kuala Lumpur and to encourage community empowerment. The KL Fashion Weekend aims to position itself as a national platform. And here I have to thank Afika for my beautiful outfit, which is made uh, with natural dyes and look at the beautiful shawl. And it weighs about five kilos, I think. <laughs> and it's definitely for the monsoon weather. <laughs> and also thank you to Ash Majid for this beautiful batik choker with a wonderful um, silver uh, pendant. And you will see the wonderful um, clay creations that she puts on her batik. Chokers, they're really beautiful. Okay, something a little bit different. To open our presentation today, we'd like to present Mek Mulong, which is a traditional form of dance theater originating from the state of Kedah, which in the olden days was a means of communication through entertainment. And it will be performed by Baizam Generation, led by Zamzuria Zahari, who's a very prominent cultural activist. And she's also the Dean of the Dance Faculty of Aswara, Mek Mulong. <laughs>
So we'd now like to present to you our first designer, who is no stranger to the fashion scene of Malaysia. He's dressed many global personalities and he has now been residing for many years in Langkawi. We present to you Faisal Abdullah's Ked Depot Cruise Line 2022, themed Simplicity of Spirit. The collection is made up of 12 looks and is named after the elements of the sea, Laut, Aur, Omba, Selat, Pantai, and Arus. And uh, just as a matter of interest, eight years ago, I was actually the MC to launch Ked Depot. So I'm so excited that eight years later, I can be here and introduce Fajal Abdullah's Cat Depot Cruise Collection 2022.
Our second designer, Atma Alam, is Langkawi's most prominent batik brand, um, who's known nationally and internationally, and designed by the daughter of the owner, Ila Azahari. We present Atma Alam.
How about a round of applause for our Mekmulong musicians, our Baizam generation. Isn't it wonderful that we can have a fashion show and we have our own music for the fashion show. We don't have to have some foreign music. That's really, really special. Now we have something also extraordinarily special. It is a collaboration between the musicians of Baizam generation and Dodi Muhammad. It's a fusion of Mekmulong and Italian opera. for you today, Dodi Muhammad and Zamzurani and of course by some generation. Okay, back to the fashion show. Next up on our list of designers is Ash Majid Langkawi. I'm going to take this off. And that's the design of this amazing choker that I'm wearing. It's, she's a luxury batik accessories designer specializing in beautiful bespoke but it chokers. She used to be a bridal designer, so it's now becoming popular among the well-heeled for her extraordinary handcrafted batik chokers. The sole jewelry designer of the KL Fashion Weekend 2021, presenting the limited edition Essence of Langkawi collection, a stunning presentation designed and handcrafted by the very talented Ash Majid. So everything you see on the runway is sourced exclusively from Langkawi. 
from the batik textile, the kaftan material, all the handmade ceramic pendants. So are you ready to be transported to the jewel of Kedah's exotic beaches and shores? Please put your hands together for the essence of Langkawi by Ash Majid of Langkawi. Thank you. 
now we come to our final designer from Langkawi. We hope that you have enjoyed your little trip to Langkawi while sitting in Rumah Chaukit. You know, this is uh, the original house of Mr. Chaukit when he was in Kuala Lumpur. I shouldn't call it a house, right? A mansion, a mansion. So we've come to Jafika Couture, which is what I'm wearing, and that's a brand name that creates 100% original, handmade, ready-to-wear, traditional fashion batik that reflects our traditional style and culture, and each collection is created by using natural dye with a contemporary look and a very comfortable feel. Um, so the unique techniques in the batik design are all inspired from nature. So please welcome the collection of Jafika Couture.
these amazing colors. Those are all natural dyes. Natural. So now we're going to end our presentation today with our last performance by Met Mulong and the Baizam Generation. We'd like to thank all of you for coming. We just had a little hujan rahmat in the Chowkit courtyard. So be careful when you leave and stay safe. Thank you. KL Fashion Weekend. The uh, collection is called Simplicity of the Soul. So it's time now to enjoy yourself, be yourself. I think a, a, a woman should now enjoy being a woman, uh, not, a, not, a, not a wife, not a daughter, not a socialite, not the corporate woman, but being a beautiful woman to enjoy herself. I hope uh, Kuala Lumpur Fashion Weekend can uh, go across the shores and uh, 
maybe inshallah next year 2022 KL Fashion Weekend is uh, will be held in Langkawi. That's my aspiration, my hope for this year. Uh, well, saya dari Atma Alam Batik. Uh, kita dari Pulau Langkawi. Uh, my parents, which is the owner of Atma Alam Batik, lah. My mum, dia memang batik artis. And then of course, with the support of the government and all, we are now one of the must visit uh, place in Langkawi. So basically, this design, I will call it rebirth. It's, what I mean by that is because of due to the COVID, yeah. I really want to focus on the painting of the the batik painting that my mom uh, make. The batik is really art that is dying. I hope our batik can get to not just Malaysian market, even worldwide, you know. Saya bawa uh, tamatnya sumpahan masuri, tamat uh, tujuh keturunan. Dan lepas habis tu, kira perkembangan macam mana langkawi itself. Bak saya memang bidang batik. So, saya gabungkan semua teknik batik dalam tu dia ada trap, ada chanting, ada stamping, dia ada tie dye. Jadi combinekan semua sekali. Warna saya gunakan natural dye, warna daripada alam, daripada kulit kunyit hidup, kulit buah pinang. Kita akan combine juga dengan air daripada bunga raya, air daun pandan. Semua macam memang saya guna natural. Harapan saya untuk saya sebab bagi saya batik ni terlalu besar. Dan fashion ni pun terlalu luas dan besar. Cuma apa yang saya bawa, saya tetap kekalkan ciri tradisional daripada teknik batik itself dan fashion tu sendiri. Hi everyone, I'm Ash Majid. Um, I'm a designer of batik necklace accessories, which is batik uh, choker, which is menggunakan batik Malaysia. And then for this special event uh, for KL Fashion Weekend, I menggunakan batik yang dihasilkan di Langkawi dan juga uh, pendant kita dibuat I buat sendiri menggunakan uh, ceramic juga di made di Langkawi juga wow, our tagline for this time is everything Langkawi okay my inspiration mostly are from our traditional um, doko ataupun uh, kebaya pendants which is uh, usually is traditionally wear dengan baju kebaya and everything but I make it more hip more cool for you to wear it every day okay my expectation for my accessories Basically, I want to promote Malaysia through my accessories and also promoting Langkawi through my accessories. Yes.